Portuguese were actually the first to start the process of colonization in India. And um, I know there is uh, some literature on it which makes it look as if they chanced upon India, which is not at all true. Right. They planned that uh, journey for almost two, two and a half years or three years or something, and they came with the very clear agenda of um, you know, colonizing the Indian people who are Hindus at that time, largely speaking. And, um, you know, this part of the subcontinent, it was sort of, there weren't any direct trade routes from India to Europe at that time. They were to Arab, mm -hmm. Arab countries, but not to Europe. So the main goal of the Portuguese was to open up trade routes between India and Europe. And uh, so they were the first to come to India and they first came to Malabar. Uh, I, I don't want to go into a whole lot of detail because that will be a whole talk in its own self. But right. they first came to Malabar and, um, you know, they had um, a very initially, you know, they had a very sour relationship with the Hindus there. And then eventually they were driven out of the Malabar region when they finally went to the Konkan region. and they settled down in Goa and established the Inquisition there. So, um, uh, of course, uh, there's a lot to speak even about the Portuguese, but um, their history of persecution started in Malabar. So even in uh, Malabar, they carried out atrocities, they burnt all the ships of um, the Indians of the Malabar region with the Indians in them. So the Hindus, they were mostly Hindus, they were uh, in those ships and they burnt those ships on the waters, even while coming to, uh, you know, India, they, there were certain sea battles as well. And even on the Indian coast, they had a long drawn battle on the coast and they were eventually driven out of there. Uh, 